everyone welcome to the session in this session we discuss the following question which says find the sum to n terms and hence find the sum to infinity of the series 1 plus 2 into 1 upon 3 plus 3 into 1 upon 3 square plus 4 into 1 upon 3 cube plus and so on consider the arithmetic or geometric series a plus a plus d this whole into r plus a plus 2d this whole into r square plus a plus 3d whole into r cube plus and so on plus a plus n minus 1 into d and this whole into R to the power n minus one plus and so on. This arithmetic or geometric series is a series. each term of which is found by multiplying the corresponding terms of an ap and a gp where we have the ap as a plus a plus d plus a plus 2d plus a plus 3d plus and so on plus a plus n minus 1 into d plus and so on this is an ap then the gp is 1 plus r plus r square plus r cube plus and so on plus r to the power n minus 1 plus and so on this is the gp so multiplying the corresponding terms of this ap and this gp we get the series that is arithmetic or geometric series this is the key idea that we use for this question let's now move on to the solution we are given the series that is the series and we are supposed to find the sum of the series to n terms and also the sum to infinity The given series is one plus two into one upon three plus three into one upon three square plus four into one upon three cube plus and so on. As you can see, that this is a arithmetic. geometric series let sn be the sum of n terms of the series that is sn is equal to 1 plus 2 into 1 upon 3 plus 3 into 1 upon 3 square plus 4 into 1 upon 3 cube plus and so on plus n which is the nth term of the AP one plus two plus three plus four plus and so on into nth term of the GP one plus one upon three plus one upon three square plus one upon three cube plus and so on and this nth term would be one upon three to the power n minus one. Now we have the GP one plus one upon three plus One upon three square plus one upon three cube plus and so on plus one upon three to the power n minus one. Here the common ratio r is equal to one upon three. So next we multiply both sides by one upon three. So here we have one upon three into s n is equal to one upon three into one becomes one upon three, and we write one upon three here. Plus one upon 
3 into 2 into 1 upon 3 becomes 2 into 1 upon 3 square plus 1 upon 3 into 3 into 1 upon 3 square becomes 3 into 1 upon 3 cube plus and so on plus n minus 1th term of this arithmetic geometric series into 1 upon 3 and that becomes n minus 1 into 1 upon 3 raised to the power n minus 1 plus this nth term into 1 upon 3 and that becomes n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. Now next, subtracting the two, we get, that is, subtracting SN and 1 upon 3 SN, we would get 1 minus 1 upon 3, this whole into SN is equal to 1 plus 2 minus 1, whole into 1 upon 3 plus 3 minus 2 whole into 1 upon 3 square plus 4 minus 3 and this whole into 1 upon 3 cube plus and so on plus n minus this n minus 1 so that would be n minus n plus 1 and this whole into 1 upon 3 to the power n minus 1 minus n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. This is further equal to 2 upon 3 sn is equal to 1 plus 1 upon 3 plus 1 upon 3 square plus 1 upon 3 cube plus and so on plus 1 upon 3 to the power n minus 1 minus n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. Now as you can see that this forms a geometric series and here the sum of the series is equal to a that is the first term which is 1 into 1 minus r to the power n and r is the common ratio which is 1 upon 3 so 1 upon 3 to the power n and this whole upon 1 minus r, that is 1 minus 1 upon 3. And so, this is equal to 3 upon 2 into 1 minus 1 upon 3 to the power n. So, the sum of this geometric series is 3 upon 2 into 1 minus 1 upon 3 to the power n the whole. So, we get 2 upon 3 sn is equal to 3 upon 2 into 1 minus 1 upon 3 to the power n and this whole minus n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. Thus, Sn is equal to 9 by 4 into 1 minus 1 upon 3 to the power n the whole minus 3 upon 2 into n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. So we have sum of the series to n terms is equal to 9 upon 4 into 1 minus 1 upon 3 to the power n minus 3 upon 2 into n into 1 upon 3 to the power n. Now here we know that the common ratio which is r is equal to 1 upon 3 and this is less than 1. So as n tends to infinity limit n tends to infinity 1 upon 3 to the power n is equal to 0. So now Sum of the series to infinity, that is S infinity, is equal to limit n tends to infinity 9 upon 4 into 1 minus 3 to the power n the whole minus 
3n upon 2 into 1 upon 3 to the power n. Power limit n tends to infinity 1 upon 3 to the power n is 0. So we get this is equal to 9 upon 4 into 1 minus 0 minus 3 upon 2 into 0. Since 1 upon 3 to the power n is 0, so n into 1 upon 3 to the power n would also be 0. Thus, this is equal to 9 upon 4. That is, s infinity is equal to 9 upon 4. So we have sum of the series to infinity is equal to 9 upon 4. So this is our final answer. That is the sum of the series to infinity and sum of the series to n terms. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.